Alright, sit down. Wait, what's up with Squidward? Why is Squidward's face all serious now? Oh, wait. Dude, that's not SpongeBob, that's a Sponge Clone! What? Uh oh. I am real Sponge. I am real SpongeBob? Yeah, you're definitely not. Dude, this guy's creeping me out. Oh! Where are you going? Bro, is he twerking on me? What is going on, bro? Hey, everyone, and welcome to SpongeBob's Evil Clone. Well, here goes nothing. Oh. What the? He got like a plankton. He got plank, plankton robots in there, bro. Why does it look like he's standing like. <laughs> okay, this is pretty cool. This is like a little cinematic movie. What are you up to? Oh, okay, that has to be the cloning machine, no doubt. Oh, what is that, a freaking plankton transformer? Is that the sponge clone? It is the sponge clone. Oh my god, why do you make him so ugly though? <laughs> okay, oh. Okay, W didn't move Alice's uh, ship to run, either interact, due to dropped objects. Hey, Patrick, oh my god. What is wrong with that dude, bruh? He's definitely not sober. Okay, uh, hello, Squidward. Good evening. Bad evening. Bad evening, of course, something you would say. What? So what do you want? <laughs> Dude, he's, he's already being rude right off the bat. Ah, okay, one Krabby Patty, dear sire. Thank you. you are not welcome. Of course you would say that. I should have expected that. Hey, what is that? Is it SpongeBob? I am SpongeBob. The heck, they got a SpongeBob mascot now? <laughs> It looks silly. All right, uh, sit down, I guess. Okay, uh... I see the Krabby Patty right there. Why is he not... Oh, Spongebob's pulling up. Ahoy, me boy! Good evening, sir. Hey, Spongebob, good evening. Do you want hot sauce in your patty? Oh, that does sound kind of fire. Yes, please. Make it extra. Okay, sir, just a minute. Ah! Holy crap. What was that? Well, that was scary. I will go to check. Can you do me a favor? All right, man. Sure, Spongebob. There Spons is another in the kitchen with Taz. Do it and I will give you the patty for free. I have to check the boys. Great, so now we got to do some labor to get a free Krabby Patty. Oh, man. I guess so. We have another option, right? Well, you got a big old head and a big old nose, Squidward. All right, um, here's the list. Uh, one, throw the trash in the trash can. Put Mr. Krabs' money in the box. Oh, great. So they want us to... Ugh, they got flies on there? What is that? Alright, so, uh... Wait, is that Plankton? That is Plankton! He's already trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula, bro. Alright, so we're supposed to collect the trash and throw it all away. Great. Alright, and that is the final piece of the trash. Okay, so now we gotta go uh, put the money in the box, Mr. Krabs Bunny. Which should be in his office. Oh my god, look at all this money. Why can't I just run off with the money, bro? It's big balling, dude, look at this! I have to join the industry. Alright. Is that it? There's one more stack. Oh, two more stacks over here, actually. Alright, and we're done. We shall be rewarded with the free Krabby Patty, man. And get out of here, Plankton. Alright, sit down. Wait, what's up with Squidward? Why is Squidward's face all serious now? Oh, wait. Dude, that's not Spongebob. That's a sponge clone. What? Uh-oh. I am real Spongebob. I am real Spongebob? Yeah, you're definitely not. I am not fake. People, When people say they're not a the thing, they're usually the thing. I'm the most real Spongebob. I'm the well. Look at his nose, dude. What the heck? He will make you. 
Okay, so he's gonna make a poison Krabby Patty. What? I did so. Dude, this guy's good man. Oh! Where are you going? Bro, is he twerking on me? What is going on, bro? His eyeballs are like popping out of his socket. Oh my god, this is a nightmare. What? Okay, what am I witnessing right now? I'm kinda scared. Can I, can I leave? What the heck just happened, dude? I have to turn on your flash. Oh, okay, so now the real nightmare has begun. Okay, the secret lies within the alphabet order. XXR. Okay, so you gotta put the code in order, I see. Okay, so it's F, F, E, F, E. Is it fear? It's, it spells fear. We need to spell fear. Wait, what? But there, it's numbers. Okay, so I guess we have to put the numbers in the in the order they're in in the alphabet so so what's the first one f so i guess it would be six and then e is five and then a is one okay and r is like is 18 so please work we got it i told you bro big brain big brain powers okay let's what is this place oh no Dude, it's so dark. Okay, sometimes you need a flashlight to see things as they should be. Low key, this game is dropping some knowledge right now. Ain't gonna lie. Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. Ooh, what's that noise, bro? Okay, it's a dot and under. I did not expect that. Six, five, one, one, eight. All right, so we gotta be careful because SpongeBob's out there roaming. But it is kind of difficult to see him because it does get pitch black. So just gotta keep a lookout. Okay, whenever the music changes, that means he's in that room. So that's just a little hint. Bro, he keeps opening doors. Shiny objects. Oh my god, what? It's a Mr. Mr. Krabs robotic. What? There's animatronics, dude? Kick me here? If only I could, I would. Trust me, Patrick. Okay, so we need to grab like a shiny... Oh no, he's coming, is he? I think he's nearby. So we need to find something th that we can place that we can place inside of that that one whatever that thing is right there. Oh look there he goes. What a freak man. Okay, let's go 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 go. This is my time to shine. Get out of here. Let's go look for that shiny object, whatever it is. I'm gonna find it one way or another. Okay, uh, he's back there, so I should have closed the door so I can know he's coming that way. Okay, this is a super long tunnel. Now, I'm not gonna lie, there's endless doors, dude. It was like never ending. Okay, so it's the one dot underscore, then two dots. Oh, golden spatula. <gasps> the key. Okay, I found the key. I don't know what it's for. Oh no, I think he's coming towards us. Hopefully, there's not a another way around. Okay, one. Two, two, two dots. Four underscore. What do those things mean? Oh, okay, so uh, it's a code. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Okay, let's go up here. I don't know where this takes me. Oh crap. I need to hide. I need to hide. Okay, so I actually went to go look for the uh, the codes on the walls and then I'm trapped here. As you can see, um, 
I think I remember it. Oh my god. Okay, uh, seven. I can't press the numbers. Why can't I press it? I need to solve the code. Bro, what? How do I solve? I thought you just pressed the numbers. Oh, I think we need to turn the power on first. That's why it's not working. Because I did see like a lever here. Wow, a missing lever. We need to find... We need to find the thing uh, to turn the power on. Oh, great. It's a dead end. All right, so let's go look for the lever so we can turn the power back on and then we can input the code. Okay, where's this? there's got to be something around here, right? Come on. Oh, no. Swim dog's going to say. Oh, wait. I see it. The Alaskan bullworm. Of course he ate it. Oh, no. Swim dog. Okay, so now we have to run back to where that power the, the, to flip the switch for the power was. But first, we gotta get around SpongeBob. Okay, we activate the power. Where's the right about here? Nice. We can actually see if SpongeBob comes down the hallway now. Okay, so the way you do the code is you correlate the numbers in the order. So yellow's like the like the one, two, three, four. Yellow's the fourth number, right? And then whatever the symbols pertain to the dots, it gives you one number. For example, that is three underscore. That is eight. Okay, so I actually seen all the codes already. And it's time to input it. Oh no, is he coming this way? Okay, it's not. Bro! He's playing games with me. Okay, so if I'm not mistaken, it's uh, 798652. No? Oh no, I got it wrong. Hold on. Please work. Thank you. Oh my lord, bro. So many tries. Okay, oh, Plankton? Wait, so we're actually helping Plankton out? What's going on? Oh, thank goodness, I finally escaped. Who are you anyway? I'm Plankton, and I need your help to get out of this cage. Seriously, you're so small, you can easily walk out the cage. That is true, bro, he literally fits well, through the bars. Well, it may seem that way, but your comment about me being small did stick. <laughs> My bad, man. Okay, I'm sorry, you're the biggest thing in the ocean. <laughs> Oh, well, wow. the thing is, the creepy sponge underestimated me and thought I couldn't escape from a cage three times my size. Can you believe it? <laughs> All right, well, that's quite a feat. My apologies for underestimating you. No worries, we don't have time to dwell on it. We need to head to my lab and create a weapon to deal with that creepy sponge you mentioned. Wait, but didn't he create the creepy sponge? I'm confused. Wait, you created it? Yes, yeah, unfortunately. He did. But let's focus on finding a solution. We'll create a weapon that can effectively combat it. Come on. All right, lead the way. All right. Uh, are you are you getting out? What's going on? Okay, I'm like, do I leave that man behind? What do I do, bro? Oh. Oh crap! Wait, did it start? I think I was supposed to dodge that. Okay, you are. <laughs> I'm like, what? Okay, so there's multiple sponge clothes. And the throwing freaking crates at our motorboat, man. Am I supposed to, like, shoot back? I don't understand. I think the blue boxes are friendly. Because usually blue is friendly and red is bad. But I'm not sure in this case. So. Okay, thank you. Oh, my God. Imagine that still killed me. I'm going to rage quit so hard. A few moments okay, later. Okay, seems like we made it to the laboratory. Oh, we did. Nice. Oh my god, this thing looks sick. Dude, look at this. It's like, what is that? Like a bat? That is awesome, man. Oh, they got a gun right there. I ain't gonna lie, Plankton. You are a master builder, dude. Pretty sick. Alright, let's go talk to him. Alright, let's see what he has to say. What now? To create the weapon, I need something very special. You must get a group of tiny Spongebobs and a cup of coffee. But what? they can only be found in the alternate reality. What does that even mean? Wait, tiny Spongebobs and a cup of coffee? That's unusual. How do I get them? In the alternate reality, the evil sponge has caused chaos and disruption. But that's where the tiny Spongebobs and the cup of coffee exist. I can't believe we're doing this, but it's time of the essence. What do I need to do? I've prepared a special grappling gun. Use it to enter the machine that will transport you to the alternate reality. One. Alright, this is strange and a risky mission, but I'll do whatever it takes. I'll take the grappling gun and enter the machine. Wish me luck.
Okay, uh, is that the grappling gun over there? Okay, it is. Nice. And then, how do we enter this machine? We go in here? Okay, nice. It's doing, it's doing the thing. As you can clearly hear it. Okay, so it's some sort of time machine, huh? That is interesting. I've never, I've never pictured it to be, uh, to look like this. I'd imagine something like the Call of Duty zombies when you teleport to the, on the Kino, on the Kino map, you know? Oh. Uh, it looks like the game is broke, is breaking or something. <laughs> Hold the left mouse button to grapple, space to jump. Oh, there you go. I'm like, what do I do? Holy crap, I'm Batman now. All right, so I'm so supposed, to, supposed to find the SpongeBob's all there. I see one down there. No! Oh my god, that was so close. Oh no, SpongeBob! SpongeBob! Oh my god! Oh, uh, what? I don't think that was supposed to happen. Okay, take me up. Okay, I gotta swing back and forth now. This is insane. SpongeBob, grab my hand! No! Oh my god, okay, this is gonna take forever. This is gonna take longer than I anticipated. Okay, so I don't know if this is gonna work. It's not. Oh wait. And did it work? Okay, I collected them all because they kept saying 8 out of 9 and I couldn't find a 9th SpongeBob. And I was like, what am I doing wrong? But I guess the ninth object was a coffee all along. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, let's just run. Oh no. Now we're getting chased by the giant potato SpongeBob looking. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, left to right. I don't know. Let's just go left. Okay, he's still behind us. Dude, this is terrifying. Oh my god, he's catching up. Bro, there's more than one? Oh my god! How is he catching up so quick? It doesn't feel like I'm sprinting, but I'm sprinting like I'm holding the sprint button. Okay, I'm not sure if this is a maze. I think it is. Oh my god, there's another one. They just keep multiplying. I want to look back. Oh. Well, hello there, friend. F is for friends, remember that, SpongeBob. And you, oh no, F is friendship, U is for you and me. Oh my god! They just keep coming out, dude. So, uh, just to let you know, I'm not having a good time right now. I'm scared for my life. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna end. <laughs> Please let this be the ending. Oh my god, it's just shaking crazier. It's getting more intense by the second. It's a dead end? No, it's a light. It's a light! I see the light! Oh. Okay, nice. We actually made it back. Oh no, what happened? Dude, it seemed like Plankton got attacked while we were on the other side. <gasps> He's dead! Plankton was dead on the ground. To be continued? No shot, man. No, they left us with a cliffhanger in the end. All right, you guys. Well, that was Sponge, SpongeBob's Evil Clone. Dude, this game was awesome. It was amazing. It's probably, I'm not gonna lie. It's probably one of the best SpongeBob games since I played ever since uh, that other game came out. I forgot the other get name of the game where this buff SpongeBob was chasing you and then Shrek comes out. I forgot the name. That one was pretty good too, but this one's pretty awesome. I put this one up there on the top tier list of scary SpongeBob games ever created, man. Well, shout out to the dev, something chaos. Um, I'll link the game in the description down below. Can't wait for part two, and I'll see you guys in the next one.